With good news for today from Baptist Press, I'm Brandon Porter. Southwestern Baptist Theological Seminary student Mang Singh recently became a part of history when he served as the narrator for the Zoe language translation of the world-famous Jesus film. The effort marked the film's 2000th available language. The Jesus film depicts the life and ministry of Jesus Christ, and it's the world's most translated film, according to the Guinness Book of World Records. Since its release in 1979, it has been viewed by billions of people around the world and resulted in more than 600 million decisions for Jesus Christ. Singh, who is from Myanmar, said Zo is one of the more than 50 dialects that's spoken by the Chen people there. It was the last of the Chen languages to receive a biblical translation. In his new role on the Perry Township School Board, Southern Baptist Pastor Re Mang hopes to help provide quality education to the community's diverse population. Mang, the senior pastor of Falam Christian Church in Indianapolis, was elected to one of the school board's three positions during the midterm elections. He'll serve a four-year term. He received the highest percentage of votes of any of the seven candidates and becomes the first ever Burmese American to be elected to the school board. According to TV station WTHR, Central Indiana has the largest concentration of Burmese Americans in the nation with around 25,000. Good news for today is made possible through our friends at The Voice of the Martyrs, a nonprofit organization that serves persecuted Christians around the world. Founded in 1967 by Richard and Sabina Wormbrand, VOM is dedicated to inspiring believers to deepen their commitment to Christ and to fulfill His Great Commission, no matter the cost. Find out more and sign up for their free monthly magazine at vom.org slash goodnews. Members of Rescate Church, the only Hispanic Southern Baptist Church in Alaska, have seen great spiritual fruit the last couple of years and desire to continue growing their ministry by planting more Hispanic churches throughout the state. Mario Morales, the pastor of Rescate, said despite the churches essentially having to start over after the COVID-19 pandemic, the congregation has grown to 25 members and they've baptized seven people in the last year. Beyond his family, Morales says most of the members of the church have come from a unique outreach his job at Home Depot. Morales is the only Spanish speaker who works at the store, and therefore any Hispanic customers who need help are sent his way. Many of the members of the church have come through these conversations and connections. His job at Home Depot is not just an avenue to finance his ministry, but it's also a part of his ministry, he told Baptist Press. Find more stories like this at our website, baptistpress.com. Thanks for listening to Good News for Today.